Eh, pa mi gente, back with the last piece of the puzzle for my enlightened evening journal. And that's a very important one, one that I must say I'm still working on every day. Um, what that piece is, is to write down our plans and tasks for the following day. Now, where that's hard for me right now is um, being at home, spending this winter with the girls. I am not used to all this quote-unquote extra time. Um, trying to figure out that balance right now, taking advantage of the time that I could spend with them after all the hours that I have been putting in over the years. Um, they are my priority. Being a father is at the top of my list. And for me right now, that means dedicating a lot of time to them, not really knowing what's coming up next. Um, so that's where I've been finding the importance of blocking off time. It's very important to go into your next day with kind of a structure in mind. If not, you'll go in aimlessly and you're going to be reactive. I mean, things will happen daily. I'm sure you know what that's all about, you know. Got to run here, got to run there. Before you know it, you're putting your head down. You're thinking, what just happened with the last 12 hours of my life? Right? You get to that journal uh, and you see all these blank lines and you realize you didn't do anything that you had told yourself you were going to do. But again, that's this journey. That's the beauty of it. Just have your block time. Make sure you put in as much of your day as possible in it. Um, what I like to do is at least write down in terms of morning, afternoon, evening, and a point for each. If you're going to work most of your day, well, then you could write that in. Where I find having these allotted times really gives you is a point of reference for your morning. When you're thinking about what is going to come up in your day, and your intentions for that day. Um, it helps to know obviously where you're going. So you know what intentions to set. And then it also primes your mind. So that you do get your day's blessings. Your wins. As well as that day's teachings. So this all goes hand in hand. Believe me. It's something that I've been practicing. That's been helping me move forward. And it's something that I'd love to hear about on your end. You know have you been following all the steps. Awesome. Again, I'm a proud supporter. I'm a teammate in this journey as we go along. Um, please let me know what you've thought so far as we culminate this part. And tomorrow I'll be getting into more of what I've done in terms of steps. I'm also thinking this week open up in terms of my story. Different things that have been going on in my head as to how to really plan this out and make it all flow. So uh, yeah. I'm excited for what's to come. I hope that journal is looking nice and full. And uh, you have yourself a blessed evening. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye for now.